Oh. Oh no 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 no. I want that. Level 86. No no. No. I'm not, I'm not gonna risk it. It's like instant death. Didn't even see that before. Right here we are. Okay. Main quest: Echoes of the past meet Yennefer at the site of the magic cataclysm. Yeah, I think that's how you say. You're mad, woman. <clears throat> mad, I say. Maybe. But You're a mad, woman. Reason. You're mad. You to battle it. shoulder to shoulder Damn. with a witcher. But the mask of Orberus is no trifle. Actually, what what level do I need to be for this? Level 72, 79. All right, that's okay. <clears throat> I always like to make sure that I've done lots of uh, witcher contracts and side quests before I do the main quest. I, I want to be like a higher level than the uh, suggested you level. You clear on the other side of the island. Quest. Good. <laughs> May all Skellige know. Jennifer of Vengerberg is a common thief. Control oh. yourself, Druid. I haven't stolen anything. I've merely borrowed something and fully intend to return it. Ha! The generosity. Just one small problem. Once used, the mask is rendered completely worthless. Not to mention the risk you'll bury us alive and all the Isles with us. Uh, what are you talking about? Barry, what are you talking <clears throat> about? She's not told you? Might have expected as much. The myth is that Orberus created the mask when the envious seas swallowed his beloved. Unable to bear the prospect that he would never again see his betrothed, Orberus made the mask, which would allow him to peer into the past. He knew, however, that he could only use it once. So he waited. Waited until his longing grew so strong that it became unbearable. When the sea learnt of the mask, it was quick to respond. It made known its threat that whosoever <coughs> used the mask would bring the sea's wrath down on them. For in vengeance, <coughs> the sea would rise and flood all the lands and drown the living. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not going to ask if anyone's ever used it because I just heard him say to Yennefer that if you use the mask, no one else will be able to ever use the mask again. So obviously that question's a... Uh, how do you get it? Where get this mask? Sailors from Clan Dimmon pulled it from the sea near the Njord Trench. Oh, oh, yes, but how can you be tonight? sure this Ooh. is Urberos's mask? Its appearance is exactly as described in the myths. You believe the myths? Only ignorant fools belittle their significance. Besides, it's not the myths that are on trial here. It's the thief. Theft or no theft, Krach gave us free reign. First off, this might indeed be his isle. But we, the druids, watch that no alien magic takes hold here. <clears throat> Secondly, after the cataclysm occurred, Krach turned to us for help and trusted this site to our care. Third, she's uh, she's used the mask. What was that? No, Jennifer's used the mask. She's <laughs> she's she's just gone and used the mask while we were talking. I guess she was probably thinking or just use uh, Geralt as a distraction, talking with the, the, the druid guy. Yeah, so I started playing The Witcher 3 at the beginning of December. So, uh, yeah, I've pretty much been a whole month playing this game. First week into the new year, January. Done about 17 videos, 17 streams of this game. And, uh, 
I think we're about more than halfway through now. Still got to go to Care More and haven't been there yet. Great. Oh, Fogwitz. No, I don't like these things. Uh, protective Shield, Gwen. That's it. Um, let me see what oil I need to use for them. Keep. Foglets, foglets. <laughs> Necro, necrophage oil, moon dust. The, the the moon dust doesn't really work. I've I've used it before. It doesn't really seem to do anything. The oil does. Whoa! 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 I'm ready for that. I saw the foglets. I meant how they get here. The power of the mask summoned them. What now? The mask reveals the past, <clears throat> but only in certain places. <clears throat> places where past events left a strong magical imprint. Take it. <coughs> Want me to wear it? Yes. I'll cast a spell that will let me see through your eyes. Well, let's go. This way. Already found the first spot. Jay, hold on. Let me just save the game. I I completely forgot how how massive this game is. If, it, if it's taken this me one month on just in Any instructions? Velen, No Man's Lands, uh, Novograd, Oxenfor, it's basically doing all the side quests, all the Witcher contracts, and then doing the main quests, main storyline up to this point. Geralt stopped yeah, it's taken a whole mask. month. Uh, use the mask, how do I use it? Oh, that's cool. Right, I've just used it. But I need to use use it and follow these two ghosts. I'm doing something wrong. What's that? A portal? Two people emerged from it. The woman was Siri. How can you know? The way she moved, like a witcher. Seems they went that way. Come, let's find the next spot. Ready? 
Use the mask. Ah, oh, you killed him. All right. Guess uh, Yennefer's coming in, coming in handy. Yeah? He's managing to kill one of them, so I can finish off the other. Watch out! What was that? Mm. So Siri and someone sort, else. So powerful that even the echo was dangerous. They must have I been wager it destroyed chased the by the, uh, the wild and her companion weren't harmed. I saw them escape. Let's see where to. Place is creepy. I don't like it. Nor do I. Anyone here when this happened had a slim chance of surviving. I know what you're thinking, but don't worry. Siri can take care of herself. They went this way. Don't get hit. Tell you two hits and you're dead with his uh Yeah, see that? Oh Even even when you dodge still manage to get hit. Chased Siri. See that? Might have wounded her. She escaped through another portal. Know where it led? <laughs> Magic residue trail leads to Velen. Any chance you can figure out where Siri's companion fled to? His portal's got to be nearby. I'll try to find it. Come. I use these for uh, YouTube thumbnails. Pretty good way of doing it. Capturing that mask again. Nice fight. One repelled the other with powerful magic, then fled through a portal. A mage? Most likely. It's Ciri's companion and the one who wounded her. How do you know? I don't. Making an educated guess. They both appeared in the previous visions. Ciri's got a powerful ally. The mage who was with Siri fled too. Know where? <clears throat> hmm. <clears throat> his trace path leads to Velen as well. But the target coordinates of his portal differ from those of Ciri's. The explosion must have disrupted his <clears throat> teleportation. I like ran into Kira Metz in Velen. I like how in the beginning of the game maybe, but he started she off claimed the mage came to her looking for Siri. Looking for Siri. Be surprised if it wasn't the same one. Made it Whoever all the way he is, here he to the Skellige Isles. And Siri's gone all the way back to Velen. It's like we're just going in like a round, round in a circle. Maybe something left of the one who got hit by the spell. It's clearing up. Ermion must be getting a handle on the weather. Which means he'll be free to attack us again. Are you pleased with yourselves? Look oh, at what you is. brought down on us. We'll see what Krach has to say about this. Relax. Storm's died down. You've clearly got things under control. For now! But who knows what will be a week or two on? 
Stop panicking. <clears throat> Here's your mask. It is worthless. It's an unwieldy ashtray at best. I hope you've learned something useful at least. Very. I'm talking to Geralt. You. You I'll deal with later. Oh. So? I ain't talking to you. We think a powerful curse was cast here. Mm. Plausible. Considering what happened to the wood. Do you know <laughs> upon whom? Not yet. But we know Ciri was here. She stepped out of a portal. A mage was with her. Someone chased them. They fought. Ciri was wounded but managed to escape. Where to? Velen, probably. The mage opened a portal for her. Then he fought her attacker. Yes? Is that it? Got a feeling we found something interesting. Just need <clears throat> to examine one more thing. I went flying in that direction. No, I just sometimes sometimes you capture like a good a good a good shot someone on this game using the photo mode and sometimes you don't something's pinned under that tree can you i can oh actually hold on let's see Armor's clean. No Wild blood, hunt. no sword nicks. Ciri's friend must have... What do you call it? Vaporized him. Exquisite. The armor. Though the <laughs> workmanship's unfamiliar. Can't even tell where it's from. Probably because it belonged to a rider of the Wild Hunt. What? Yeah. That's right. So it's true. The Wild Hunt. I feared as much. <laughs> First here, then on Hindersfjall. What did they want? They're looking for Siri. But why? So uh, something's happened to uh, Elder Blood Yenif flows in Yenif Siri's veins. Uh, kind of look like they've true. she can trace uh, her matrix. lineage clear back to Lara Duran, which is why the women green, in our family have always look. had extraordinary abilities. But could that truly be so important? Siri's exceptional. She travels between places yeah, look. here and other worlds. Space is no obstacle for her. Oh. Which is why the wild hunt. New, wants new to game capture. plus mode is definitely more buggy and, and glitchy compared to. Speaking of the hunt. Compared to the main game and when you play for well, the first time. It happened at least a fortnight after the cataclysm struck here on Ard Skelly. The raids raided Lofoten at dusk yeah. in a blizzard. Itself a strange grim. occurrence for that time of year. The islanders said the wraiths. They barged into their huts, killed anyone who resisted, <clears> then <throat> galloped inland, laughing fiendishly. Anyone survive? A dozen or so women and an old man. Next stop, Hindersfjall. I'll meet you on the beach near Lofoten. Uh, let's go together right now, or see you there. Mm. Let's go together. Wait, can't we go together right now? But you detest being teleported. Don't exactly like potions either, but I drink them when I have to. <laughs> you also drink them when there's no need at all. Very well. <laughs> 
Let's go. Stay close to me. Good luck to you. Inform me hmm. once you've learned <clears throat> anything new. Quite a few years since I was last in this year. But if I remember correctly, Lockton should be this way. Yeah, the cutscene's still... Raised yeah, huts and fresh graves. Gloves. Hmm, this must be it. Gathering of some kind. We've come at a bad time. There's no good time to talk about the wild hunt. Oh, it's not just a cutscene. <clears throat> That's weird. I never, I never saw that from my um, the first time I played this. What if Craven told the truth? What if he didn't abandon us? But was stop. It's like her, her gloves have just not loaded into the game. The, the graphics, I don't know what's going on. Save the game just in case. <coughs> Ritual of some kind. We'll have to wait. <coughs> we'll do no such thing. Dear sisters, pardon the interruption. But we've an important matter to discuss. Can you not see we're commemorating the dead? So. And we're looking for someone who's still alive. Please, this is urgent. <sighs> then speak. <clears throat> we're looking for a young woman, name of Siri. Ashen hair, green eyes. I'm sorry. She is not here. Unless she lies in a grave. That is, I do not recall one by that name. But I've buried so many. I may have <coughs> This, this Siri. Hmm. Uh, has she a scar here on her cheek? Yes. Yes, what happened to her? Don't know. Saw her but for a moment. Right before, before it all. She was in the stables. With Craven. A thousand curses upon him. Remember anything else? Anything at all? Only that she seemed tired. Very tired. And... and her hair was wet. Great. <laughs> so we know she bathed. Progress. I'm sorry, Scar- Craven! My apologies. Craven. Craven could have told you more. This Craven you mentioned, does he have a name? He did. Until the Elders struck him from the Saga of Ancestors. It's as if he has ceased to exist. The lore forbids anyone from touching him, speaking to him, even uttering his name. What did he do to deserve that? He fled from the wild hunt. He alone. We need to talk to him, even if it's not in keeping with your customs. You've come too late. He went to the garden to fight Morkvag. Where is this holy garden? Not far from here. North. We cultivated healing herbs there once. And now? Now we walk only as far as the tree the goddess planted. We place our offerings and make our pleas before it. Those who venture below remain in the garden forever. Morkvarg. What's that? Who, you mean? The vilest man ever to inhabit Skellige. Nothing was ever sacred to him. He attacked his own clan's lands. Took gold from Nilfgaard, killed children, pregnant women. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> know the type. They said he feared only one thing, the wrath of the gods. Morkvarg sought <clears throat> to prove how wrong they were, so he sailed to Hindusfjall to ransack the <clears throat> goddess's garden. <clears throat> this was over a decade ago. Archpriestess Ulva stood in his way. Oh. He thrust a blade between her ribs and cast her down in the mud. As her lifeblood left her, she cursed him, and Morkvarg transformed into <laughs> a beast. Curse? A monster? You've got some work to do. Mm. Yeah, we can rid of the monster. I can get rid of Morkvarg. Don't know what he's turned into, but a silver sword should do the trick. It's not that simple. There have been those who have bested Morkvarg, yet he always returns. So, it's a complex curse, meaning I need more information. I understand, but I've told you all I know. 
to speak with Toradar's son, Einar. He was in the garden when Morkvarg and his men attacked. He saw what happened. Of all the pilgrims there at the time, he alone escaped with his life. He settled in Larvik. You'll find him there at the landing, provided he's not out to sea when you arrive. And a coward who willingly seeks battle? Am I the only one who sees the contradiction? That's why he did it. Craven knew he would prove the elders wrong only if he killed Morkvarg. And thus regain his honor and his name. Trial by ordeal. Very Skelligan. I do not mock your laws. Hmm. Please also respect ours. Trial by combat. Thanks for your help. I understand you intend to enter hmm. the garden. I dislike it when foreigners enter the sacred grounds. But so be it. Custom demands pilgrims make an offering of their own blood before the tree. Craven surely did so. Unless he lacked not only courage, but respect for Freyr as well. You needn't worry about us. Geralt and I always give the gods the respect they are due. <laughs> Bow before modern Freya. Freya Priest. Find... Oh, excuse me. Find Freya's garden and look for Craven. Worried this trail might have gone cold. Even if Craven's dead, we'll manage. How exactly? You'll see when the time comes. You could stand to be nicer sometimes. I suppose. But then I wouldn't be the woman you fell in love with, would I? Yeah, but your gloves are still green. Looks like the game isn't going to fix that unless I load, load a save or reload. Load a save or reload. My, my. That must be Morkvarg. Quite the I think, I think, uh, Might even call it Skellig Isles are... It's, it's, the, it's the most beautiful... It's, it's, the, it's the most, like, visually stunning place. Out of all the other places on Watch Free Games. A crumb, uh, uh, food, uh, food. Uh, Especially when you go out in the open, you can see like <coughs> snowy mountains not, in the distance. Not again! Not again! <coughs> he doesn't seem to have signs of crazy. Wait till he gets a closer look at me. So, where should Let's go to that tree the sisters mentioned. Plan to be yourself for the goddess? Not necessarily, but Craven did. We just might pick up his scent. Wonder if I could just jump down there. No, no. I might get stuck if there's some closed doors. Craven was here. <clears throat> Look, the impression. Kneeled down on one knee <clears throat> and cut himself to make the offering. Bloodstains. See them? No. I may be inhumanly beautiful, but I don't have superhuman senses. Not like you. Which is why you should stay up here. No offense, but in that undergrowth and mud, you'd be like a... Ball and chain? Planned to say it gentler, but yeah, that's basically what I had in mind. Fine. We'll do as you say. If the need arises, I can cast spells from up here. Fine. See you later then. Don't get hurt. Remember, I need you if I'm to find Siri. 
Oh, come. I was just teasing. Fool. I need you. Period. Better? Hmm. Better. <laughs> Craven's Some been blood. down there. Flowing Can't profusely. See Trail's clear. Should lead me to him. Light prints. Craven trod carefully. Hmm. Follow Craven's footsteps. I'm gonna light up. All these fireplaces. Yeah, that looks cool. If I can remember, I think there's, I think there's something in here, something in one of these locked doors gives me a key to unlocking whatever curse is on this werewolf. I just can't remember what, what it is I need to do. From what I can rem remember from my first playthrough, we we fight Craven, we kill him, and he co then he comes back alive again, but he goes back into his cave, and then we find something in one of those locked doors. Victims. Strange. <clears throat> Is it Craven? No, this one's been here a while. What? Monster tracks. Running. <clears throat> chasing something. Looks like Mokvar got bored of sneaking around and attacked. <gasps> oh. I can't attack me. Doesn't give up easily. I 
think there's a way to climb up here. So there's the jumping here, and there's a. I think there's a, a switch somewhere. standard. One lever to choose the sluice gate, the other to work it. Now which one is which? Alright, so that, that raises that one. What the one on the right does. No, is, is it opened it? No, it isn't. I think I did it right the first time. The floodgates open, but nothing's happening. this way. Oh, no, we didn't because it's got a metal gate there on the right. Door's open. Okay. Morkvark broke through this door. God, the right smell something beyond it. Simple touch. No sign of feeding. Morkvark doesn't devour his victims. Strange. There he is. Yeah, so I do remember is that you, you fight him the first time, kill him, and then he comes back again. And you have to go down into a cave where he is. Wish to hear a story. Feels more more colder in January in the new year than in last year December. If I have to, I'm all ears. 
Warriors came. They knew they could not kill me. So they laid a trap. Chained me down. Lock me in here. Know what I did? I bit my leg off to free myself. Every bite uh, brought pain uh, and howling. I vomited blood. Mm -hmm. Biting off your own limbs hurts. Who would have thunk? You and then don't it, understand. And it grows back. This was more. It's almost like he's a morsel. My mouth burned <laughs> like following fire as if all inside me was torn <laughs> felt I would die <laughs> but I I did it <laughs> and then <laughs> I shredded them Dashed them to bits, uh, made tiny crumbs uh, uh, of those plowing heroes. Uh. Your story have a point. We're just doing some chest pounding. <sighs> the moral is. <sighs> You cannot kill me. You cannot stop me. I'm just, I'm just waiting to see if he's going to attack. Me right Break now. any fetters. So ah! Is he going to attack? Of course. Free me, or I'll return to get you again. Yeah. Oh. Throw one of them fire bombs in there while he's in there. Doesn't seem to do anything to him. Oh, that definitely did. Oh. Even though he's level 70, and I'm almost level 80, he's still doing more damage to me. Is the curse uh, makes me bite, uh, scratch, mangle. The only thing I can remember is I how to break the curse. I know if I kill him, he comes back. But before the blood can't remember what to do to break the curse. And, and I return. Listen uh, uh, carefully. Uh, undo, undo the curse. Uh, free me. Uh, finally, I will, I will reward you. Uh, I don't like being a werewolf. So, no joy in being a werewolf? Nay. It's the worst. Not the garden to which I'm bound, even. But the hunger. Anything I devour returns to ash. Ash, I cannot eat. I cannot drink. Yet I bloody live and roam and prowl. The hunger is terrible, ah, terrible. I bite my own flesh, but the smallest <sighs> morsel burns my throat, throat like I feel like tar. what he's saying, he's trying to give us 
it, everlasting the, uh, hunger. The game trying to give us curses quite, go. Goes to explain why all those corpses went untouched. But I still, Help. I still don't know. When I, when I return to shred your rip your limb from limb. <sighs> See what I can do. See and do, or I shall return. Feed Mogfag. Finish Mogfag. Feed him. Is that what it is? I will try it and see what happens. Okay, I think this is how you break the curse, but. Oh, I can't remember what it is that you feed him. I don't think you give him just any f normal food. You've got to give him something else. Quest item, rotting flesh. Let's try that. See if we can do this the easy way. Morkvarg, of my own free will, I offer you this fare. Now dig in. Won't turn to ash. Won't know until you try. Come on, a spoonful for daddy. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> this shite again! <laughs> I don't think that worked, did it? What do we give him? I can't. I seriously, cannot remember what it is. We give. <laughs> Nothing. Is this a mockery? <laughs> Think this a diversion? Uh, uh, I catch you again. Uh, I'll have reason to laugh. Uh, uh, uh I think farewell. I need see to look around to figure out what I need to do. Yeah, we need to. I can't remember what it is I need to give him. Explore the further parts of Hyperion. Prince lead to the well. Guess Craven didn't want to be eaten, preferred to drown. How's that? Let's meditate so we can get those potions back. Sorry, didn't mean to. I hope not. Let me know once you find Craven's blood. <clears throat> there, we got to find out what it is that we need to give him. That'll break the curse. You can't just give him any random food. I don't think it'll work. Damn, dead. Has been <clears throat> for a while. Is that Craven? Again, found him. And? And I've seen rot fiends in better condition than this. Shit. Fine, scrape together what you can and haul the bits up here. Take it you've got a plan? No, I just like to stare at rotting flesh. We'll talk when you get here, all right? That's Yen, charming as ever. Come on, someone wants to meet you. Putrefaction set in, but the vocal cords are intact. We might still get something out of him. She's gonna. She doesn't gonna look speak like the talkative the type. Anyone can be. She's gonna do some uh, witchcrafts. One must simply know how. 
thought necromancy was strictly forbidden. Ooh, so is premarital sex. But I'm not about to be bothered by such foolishness. Feels like it's feels like it's like one degree right now. What's going on? Oof. It's not even snowing, but it's getting freezing cold. Need any ingredients for the spell? Hmm. The blood of a newborn, a virgin's tongue, and the eye of a newt. Mind trying again without the sarcasm? <laughs> I don't need a thing. I'm a sorceress, not a village herbalist. All I need is energy. A great deal of energy. We're very lucky this place is saturated with magic. It's also considered sacred. Priestesses will be furious if you use the garden's power to revive a corpse. All the more reason to get it over with <clears throat> before they realize what's happening. Oh, I think they'll find out. We're about to make some enemies. Yeah, that's very true. We are about to make some enemies. I very don't need true. everyone to like me. I most value the opinions of those I care about. That's you, very true as well. So, can we start? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Selene, Selene, Dufresne. <laughs> Selene, Selene, Davidar. Crazy how they can bring back the dead only for like a few minutes just to speak to them and find out what happened. Some dark magic right here. Are you Craven of Lofferton? No, I. Uh... We're looking for Siri. Ashen hair, green eyes. Have you seen her? She, she's wise. Curse me. I don't care about that. What happened to her? What was she doing here? Speak. Speak! Speak! She fell almost Siri, Zirel, can you hear me? I can. I must leave you now. We will meet beneath drowned dead rock. Can you remember? Mm -hmm. Repeat it. Drowned dead rock. You're awake, and I thought you'd... Where, where am I? And who are you? It's all right. You're on Hindersfjall, village of Lofoten. They call me Skjall. But how'd I... What? We fished you out of the sea, me and that friend of yours. Help... Help me stand. I... 
I don't... I don't think you should... Less talk, more giving me a hand. Ah, that's me brother for you. Out of sight for a second, and he's already put his paws on a girl. <laughs> Astrid, you're as dim as dishwater. You know perfectly well I'm helping her up. It's a shame, I know, but I've got to interrupt your courtship. Come, we're off to the sauna. What? Why is your mouth agape like you're noodling for an eel? The sauna. Girl, you was blue as a whale when we brought you in here. Your blood <laughs> needs thawing. I'm sorry, but I must get to Drowned Dead Rock as fast as possible. I shan't force you to stay, but the rock's a ways off and you can barely walk. You best take a horse. True. Skial can prepare a horse for you. You'll have to wait a spell, but even so, you'll get there faster than on foot. <coughs> Fine, that'll do. Thank you both very much. Pish posh, there's no need. Now come, we gotta sweat the sick out of you. Where are my clothes? I've taken them already. Come on. <laughs> that man in the mask, he's from afar, isn't he? Oh, yes. Going very far away. Stop. Where exactly? Aren't you nosy? Surprised? 